technology is fundamentally reshaping both how workers find jobs and how employers find workers, and it's changing how people get the skills and credentials they need to compete in the global labor market. Sucatel started to address the problem of a lack of good resources for people who are looking to work uh, to get connected with actual jobs. Typically in emerging markets, there are no good job boards, lots of people lacking web access, or similar ways that you or I in North America or Europe might find a job. We realized that we can fill the gap between the job seekers and the job employer using the tool that all the time attached to people's bodies, which is the cell phone. It allows you via simple text message or audio hotline or web on phone if you have that access to create a basic profile about yourself if you're looking for work or a basic ad about your job if you're an employer. An SMS just came into my phone from Sukhtel telling me that there is a new opportunity for a new job so anybody is interested just apply. They invited me to a, an interview and after that I found a job. It's not just a billion people who have access to digital technologies anymore. With literally 90 plus percent of the world living under a signal, having potential access, the trick is to unleash the innovation potential uh, in as broad a community as possible. Sama means equal in Sanskrit, and our mission is to connect people living in poverty to work over the internet. We pioneered a concept called microwork, which involves breaking down large data projects from technology companies into very small tasks. And we have an internet platform that farms those tasks out to people living in poverty in East Africa, South Asia, and Haiti. What we're doing is really enabling all of these workers around the world in very unlikely locations for computer-based work to contribute piecework into a global system. The jobs typically don't exist where the people live. So we're enabling contractors the freedom to be able to work on the jobs from wherever they are in the world, whenever they want, on the skills or jobs of their choosing at the rates that they're worth in the global economy. Specifically, what our platform does is it takes a screenshot of my desktop six times an hour at random intervals to enable the client to course correct me in real time business today, it evolves much more rapidly. It's much more dynamic than it was, say, 30, 40 years ago. And often there's a big disconnect between employers and then the educational institutions in a country. The problem, there is a gap between the education and the marketplace. And when we conduct an interview with the private sector, they all tell us that graduates lack the life skills and some technical skills they need. So we said to ourselves, Let's complete the cycle and match them with trainer courses. I've learned many new topics like presentation skills, business English, and accounting software. What we learn, we actually find in uh, real life. I believe that work is at the core of human dignity. And I think it's especially true for people who've been denied any sort of formal employment and denied the ability to view themselves as professionals. Getting a better understanding of how technology can enable job creation either in different sectors or through the online economy is going to be important. And it's an ongoing, challenging process. It doesn't condense down very well, but it's a remarkable time right now.